Yes, guys, what's good? Welcome back to the channel. It is Friday, full release day, so a lot of you will be on the game now. And Road to the Knockouts, first promo of FC25 is here. Let's go. New format, new upgrade, opportunities. Just make sure I'm still recording. Yeah. All right, Road to the Knockout returns with a new range of upgrade opportunities based on the all new league phase of UEFA's Elite competition. On top of their initial boost, the Road to the Knockout squads could get up to three additional upgrades based on the club performance. Win three, three league matches, one overall. Score one goal in four league matches, plus one overall, and a roll plus plus. Finish top two in the league, playstyle plus and roll plus plus. Nice. You'll also find a range of UEFA themed content arriving throughout the two week campaign, including the Road to the Knockout squad available in packs, SBCs, objectives, rush event. Upgrade and SPCs and evolutions. Nice. Let's go. Let's have a look at what we got. Oh, look at that. Bellingham, Motomendi, Alvarez, Frimpong. Let's have a look. What is the content? Spain World Tour. Still there. Doesn't look like there's anything more. Live. Evo Arena. What is this? Here for 33 days, enter the Evo Arena live ultimate friendly and compete with your Evo players that earn rewards. Play 10 matches in the live ultimate Evo for a 75 by 5, win 1 for a 75, win 5 for a 75 by 2, and win 10 for a 77 by 7. And you get an 83 2 plus 2 overall. That's decent to be fair. Uh, Rotor Knockouts Nicholas Otamendi is here. In objectives, two star, three star, centre back. Decent pace for centre back, bit of a weird split though, isn't it? Uh, 78, 70 and 84 is a bit of a weird one. Shooting doesn't matter. Passing's okay, 82, 81, short and long. Dribbling's not the best. Defending and physicals are good. Obviously, most likely won't get an upgrade playing for Benfica, but you never know. Power header, slide tackle, bruiser, intercept, jockey, and aerial. And he's got stopper and ball playing defender plus rolls. So, yeah, not a bad card for a free one. Just for playing the game. What do you actually have to do? It's five goals in squad battles. Score 10 goals using a player from Argentina. So you get 75, 75 by two and some SP points. Concede one or less goals per match in four separate games, 75 by two. And win 10 matches in squad battles on minimum semi pro while having three Argentinian players in your starting 11. 75 by 3. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. Milestones. That will have a new milestone, but you never know. Which have a look anyway. Um, No new milestone. I don't think so. We've got a load of packs to open, by the way, for the end of the video. Nothing new. World Tour Foundation is there. Alright. Good start. Let's have a look. Come on. Full release. I'm hoping for a bronze Evo for my Cole United team. Power surge. Here we go. So it's a silver. Um. Oh, max overall 80. Pace max 93. Dribbling max 86. It's free. Supercharge a player of your choice with an all-round stat boost. Elevate their facet of their game with attributes that enhance their player in all, all areas of the pitch. So, it's max 93 pace because that's the pace that it can go up to. 77 shooting, so you get 6 shooting. 5 passing, 7 dribbling, 5 defending, and 2 physical. With weak foot upgrade as well. That is not too bad, guys, I tell you. That's a nice boost. Let's actually put someone in and see what it looks like. So if we put on out of vision, his pace goes up by eight. Which is okay. Oh Jordi Alba fits in here. Nice. El Sharari. What lad, has he still got five star skills? No. Hey, not a bad one. Not a bad one. Let's have a look. We've got cosmetic. 
club legend welcome to evolutions so just the one evo power surge it's not too bad guys it's not too bad all right sbcs so players let's go man liverpool diogo joel we'll have a look at him Haaland, Souza, Danjuma, Ali Watt, upgrades, lone base hero player pick, 77 doubles are back, cosmetic evo, team of the week upgrade, wow, earn a pack containing a team of the week player from team of the week one or two, that's nice, we'll do that as well probably, um, challenges, Roto knockout challenge one, Alright, oh, some nice stuff there then. So Diogo Jota, four star, five star, striker, right wing, left wing, decent pace, decent shooting, nice passing for a forward. Dribbling's very good. Was he four star, five star as well? Very good physicals for a striker. Obviously, most likely will get an upgrade. Chip shot, power shot, <clears throat> long ball, rapid, and relentless. That's very nice, yeah. False nine, inside forward and advance forward. Pluses, nice. Very good card. Four segments. 84, 85, 86 with a team of the week, and then 87. I think that is... I think that's good, because he is going to get upgraded, definitely. Like, at least one or two. So that's a very nice uh, SBC there. Roto Knockout Challenge 1. First own one, players from same league, minimum two, rare players three, team overall rating, minimum 65, team chemistry, minimum 12, number of players in the squad, 11. Nice and easy. What'd you get? Premium goal. Oh, it's for a premium goal pack. <laughs> Who cares? <coughs> right. Team of the week upgrade. Let's go. We'll do it now. 85 and overall one with an 84 rated squad. Right, who should we put in? 85 rated. Get rid of um, let's get rid of Walsh with an 84 rated team. Players that we're never going to use Garassi might get away with some 83s now. Uh, two Ram can go Andrich <coughs> Pellegrini and Nagasoto. See. Can we go lower? Take it lower. Yes, we can. Manum. Ah, right. there's the team of the week. That's not bad, you know. 185 and 84 rate squads, not the worst for a team of the week. Obviously, Luis Diaz is who we're looking for. Any Liverpool player, really. Yeah, some good content, guys. I'll tell you what, we'll open packs first before we go, and then we'll go and have a look at the team over on Footman. Sold some things there. Right, oh, let's look. Actually, quickly, let's um, have a look at Rush. Welcome to Rush. That's the only one. So there's no new Rush event today. Right, to the store. Got some big packs to open. I think we've got two Jumbo Rares. Rare Mega. Oh no, just one Jumbo Rare. Rare Mega, Prime Electrum, Rare Mix, 75 by 2, and a Team of the Week pick. Uh, player pack. Let's start with 75 by 2s. Walk out. Kierbon. Left back. French. Syria. Oh, Teo Hernandez. No way. Is this tradable? Oh, I don't think it is tradable, but what a pull. Let's go, boys. Come on. 75 by 2, mate. Look at that. Is he worth a bit? Oh. Welcome to the team. Let's go. I don't know. It's not a lot of him on the market either. Hopefully we can get a special player to see what the tunnel looks like. As we get a Kaku. And Carlos Soler. I didn't even realise he uh, went to West Ham to be fair. Um, right. Prime Electron Players Pack. No walkout. Left mid, German. No idea. Some woman. Buell, McGregor, Timmy Cass is in there. 
Another Liverpool player to be fair. Can't complain. Alright, rare mixed players pack. No walkout again. Gonna be Lunin from Real Madrid. Ortega in there as well. We'll sell Ortega, Man City, and Lunin from Real. Anyone else worth keeping hold of? No. Get rid of David as well. Jonathan David. Right. Rare mega pack. Come on. Give me a walkout. Oh, it's no walkout. Sent mid. It's going to be Vitinha. I think so, anyway, yeah. But he can go to the dupe pile, can't he? Um, yeah. Get rid of all that crud. John Bobo plays pack. Come on, give us that new. Give us a blue. It's no blue. There is a walkout, though. Striker. Poland. Azure, isn't it? Let's go. I think she's 87 or 88. Azure. Hey. All good fodder going towards Diego Jota. You get Raya. Linond. Ariola, Fred. Bobby Firmino. Timo Werner. Rinders. He's very good on this game, by the way. Um, sell Benitez. Argentinians myself for a little bit now because of the new um, thing in Majiggy. Right, team of the week player pack. Come on. Colombia. It's a walkout. Centre mid Portugal. Oh, it's Ruben Neves, isn't it? Ruben Neves. 86 rated, I think. Hey, not too shabby. Pretty sure he's discard, isn't he? Yeah, he is. But, hey, not bad. Could have done with a Liverpool player. So that was not bad packs, guys, to be fair. Uh, what promo packs we got? Got Road of the Week, Week 1 Foundations pack. Provisions. Obviously, I'm not going to open any FC points today. Yeah, some good content in game. Let's go have a look at the new team. Let's have a look. What objectives have we done? Oh, might have another pack here. Oh, we have. What is it? 78 by 2. Let's go. Alright, one more pack then. No walkout. Right mid. Gonna be Tusing Golf. Tusing Golf. Yeah. And Golovin. Right, let's go have a look at the new team. Road to the final. Right, here we go. Anjali. Yeah, I prefer this one, I can't lie. 12 is only 12k. CM, CDM, 3 star, 3 star. Long ball, intercept, flare, aerial. With CDM holding, CDM centre half, and deep line playmaker pluses. Decent pace for a CDM. Shooting's not the worst. Passing's good. Very good, actually. Dribbling is nice. Defending and physical's good. Very nice. Good card for Anjali. Anjali. Right, posh. Two star, three star. 12k. Wing back and attack and wing back rolls with long ball, whipped, block, anticipate, bruiser. Can only play right back, which is interesting because that pace is terrible for a right back. Um, passing's good. Obviously, he's got whip pass as well. Dribbling, not the best. Defending and physical's good. Yeah, there's, he's going to be discard. All right, we've got Moyes Keen. Three star, three star. Poacher plus chip shot, power shot, rapid flare, Traveller. Very good pace. Decent shooting. Short pass is very nice. Curve is good. Dribbling decent for a big man. He is big, isn't he? I think so. So oh, he's like six foot, yeah, still quite tall, isn't it? Heading and jumping, very nice. Good stamina. Decent card. Oh, we've got Donny van der Beek. He's at Jalorna now. CDM cam centre mid, three star, three star. Half winger, half winger cam and centre mid pluses. With finesse, slide tackle, flare, first touch, Travella. 
decent pace, good shooting, nice passing, very good dribbling. Passing's actually really good as well, actually. Defending's okay, physical's not the best. Another card that's probably going to go down in price. Otamendi, we looked at. We've got Lang from PSV. Left wing, left mid cam. 5 star, 4 star, 33k. Cam playmaker plus and inside forward plus with incisive technical flair, first touch, quick step, and Travella. Decent pace. Shooting's okay for a winger. Passing's okay. Physicals. Good stamina. Very nice dribbling. Yeah, his dribbling's good. That's not a bad card. 5 star, 4 star. I've got Benjamin Sesco. 4 star, 4 star. 135k because Leipzig could get an upgrade or two. Advanced forward and poacher pluses. Power shot, technical, flair, acrobatic and aerial. Good pace. He's very tall, isn't he? Sesco, 6 foot 5, yeah. Great pace. He's got great jumping and heading. Shooting's decent. Dribbling's good for a big man. Overall, good card. Very nice. Uh, we've got Beyond. Nathalie Beyond. 28k, 2 star, 3 star, centre back, right back, centre mid. Uh, defender plus, stopper plus, hold in plus, with power header, jockey, intercept, anticipate and aerial. How tall is she? She's 5 foot 9, so it's not the worst for a woman centre back. Uh, good pace as well. CD, oh, she can play centre mid as well, by the way. Passing's good. Physical's decent. Defending, very good. Dribbling, nice. This is a good card. I like this card. She will be down in price, but that's a decent card for centre mid CDM role. Oh, we looked at Jota. All right, we've got Koch. Two star, four star, centre back only. Defender plus, jockey, block, intercept, slide tackle, bruiser. A 17k. Got decent pace for centre back. Nice physicals. Good, really good defending. Oh, pardon me. Right, good dribbling as well. Nice short and long pass. Good dribbling for a centre back. Not bad. Right, Stefan Esquielo, three star, three star, CDM centre mid, twenty three k. Holding CDM and box to box CM pluses with finesse shot, tiki tackle, jockey, bruiser, press proven. Good pace for a CDM. Decent shooting as well. Very nice passing. Great uh, defending and physicals overall, and good dribbling. That's a good card. Villainous. We've got Cherky. 250k. Five star, five star, bloody hell. Cam, right wing, left wing. He's got Cam, shadow striker, right wing, wide playmaker, and left wing, wide playmaker pluses. With flair plus, chip shot, incisive, technical, first touch, trickster, and Travella. Decent pace for a cam. Nice shooting. Very good shooting, actually. This is the best card we've seen so far by a mile. Passing's great. Dribbling's great. Stamina 75 is decent. That is a great card for Ryan Cherky. All right, we've got Dimaco. Left mid, left back. Three star, four star. 156k. Uh, left back, attack and wing back plus. Left mid, wide playmaker plus. With finesse, power shot, incisive, long ball, whip and first touch. Uh, good pace. Obviously, you can play centre back as well. No, he can't play centre back actually. Good pace. Uh, shooting's very nice. Passing is good. Defending and physicals are good. The overall, this is a great card. He's in Hulet Gang, by the way. What a card. He'll be great in game. Alright, we've got Jeremy Doku. 1.3 million. Uh, left mid, right wing, left wing, four star, three star. Right winger, left winger, inside forward, pluses with rapid. Plus flair, first touch, trickster, quick step, cracking pace, great dribbling, very good shooting for a winger. Can play on either wing as well. Good passing, decent uh, physicals overall. What a card! Obviously, Man City will get an upgrade or two. Right, we've got Oliver Watkins currently extinct. Three star, four star, poacher plus, chip shot, power shot, rapid, press proven, relentless. Great pace. Really good shooting. Passing's not the best, but it's okay. Dribbling is good. Good heading, good jumping, nice stamina. Good physicals overall. He'll be very good in game. 
Oliver Watkins. Right, we've got Claudio Pina. 321k, left wing, left mid, Cam, 4 star, 5 star. Cam, shadow striker, left wing, inside forward, and left wing, pl wide playmaker, pluses. With finesse, incisive, tiki taka, flair, and Travella. A very good pace. She's more of a Cam, if I remember correctly. Yeah, very good pace, especially for Cam. Uh, shooting's decent, passing good, dribbling great, nice physicals, great card. Jeremy Frimpong, 800k, 4 star, 4 star, right back, right mid, right wing as well. Packing wing back and inside forward plus as well. Whip pass, jockey, rapid, flare, quick step. Obviously, cracked out pace for Frimpong. Dribbling, great. Defending and physicals are good. Defending's a bit better. Uh, passing's okay. This is more of an attacking Frimpong, if you ask me. Obviously, shooting's terrible. Actually, yeah, you're going to want to play him right wing back, maybe, if you're playing five at the back. But Jeremy Frimpel, what a card. Right, right, we've got Christian Romero. He is centre-back only, three-star, two-star, 265k. Ball playing defender and stopper, player role pluses. With intercept, slide tackle, bruiser, relentless and aerial. Decent pace for a centre-back. Short pass is okay, but his other passing is terrible. Dribbling is terrible as well, reactions is good. Defending and physicals are good. He needs upgrades, but obviously Spurs will do well in the Europa League. So yeah, not bad for Romero. Right, we've got Julian Alvarez, 1 million coins. 4 star, 4 star, striker and cam, which is nice. Shadow striker plus and false 9 plus with press proven plus, finesse, chip shot, rapid flare. Great pace, great shooting, nice passing, really good dribbling, great physicals. Yeah, no wonder he's a million coin. That is a very good card. And he obviously I'm gonna keep saying it, the upgrades. <laughs> It'll be a very good card. Right, Diani. She's right wing, right mid striker, four star, four star, nine hundred and seventy-four K. She has wide maker plus plus, uh winger plus, false nine plus, finesse shot, technical flare, quick step, and travella. Now, if you've used that goal card, you know how good she is. Um her pace is great, shooting's great, passing's good, dribbling amazing, really good physicals as well. Wow, what a card. All right, let's top it off. We got Hey Jude. Apparently 4.3 million cam centre mid, four star, four star. Uh, centre mid, uh, cam playmaker plus plus, shadow striker plus, half winger plus, relentless plus, intercept, slide tackle, technical flare. Great pace for Bellingham, great shooting, very good passing, better than very good passing, that is great, 90-90, 92 vision, uh, dribbling, great, defending and physicals are great as well, overall that is just a cracking card, to have 90 dribbling at this point in the game is crazy, 4.3 uh, mil, good luck packing him, that is all the new cards guys, let's have a look at SBCs. Yogo Jota is 194k. Team of the Week upgrades 12k. Road to the Knockout Challenge 1 is no price yet. That's not too bad. So, yeah, 194k for Jota is good, I think. Evolutions. Power Surge. Evolved Players. So, you've got who's the best one? Chervy. Mateus Hudes. That'll be a good one. Let's have a look at Prem. Premier League. Fly filters. Um, you've got Broja. Moroto. Who the hell is that? I've never heard of you. Anderson. Fits in there. Oh, Lacroix. That's a good one. Enketia. Carlos Soler. Mangala. Let's have a look at Lacroix. What a card. Great pace for centre back. That is not that's not the best, is it? <laughs> but yeah, there's not too many good ones there, is there guys? But however, that is all the content for this first promo of FC25. Um let me know what you think about it all. Let me know who you're putting into the Evo. And let me know who you're trying to pack this week as well. Because I'm gonna be going for Liverpool players, of course. Let me know if you've managed to pack any of the good cards that have come out. 
just let me know what you think about all the new content as always guys if you make this far thanks so much for watching if you did enjoy please drop a like and if you're new please sub cheers